Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is adjective phrase 72. The adjective phrase today is full-fledged. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, take it now. Let's get right to it. If something is full-fledged, it is completely developed, or someone is completely trained, uh, or someone is of full status or full rank. Okay, let's continue. Uh, it could have a second meaning, too, in relation to birds, where is really where the main meaning comes from. Uh, having a complete set of feathers. Okay, let's continue. The origin is related to the definition with birds. When a baby bird is born, it only has starter feathers, you know, even if that, uh, and cannot fly yet. Uh, as time goes on, the feathers grow thicker and stronger. Uh, this process is referred to as fledgling. Okay. The word fledge comes from the Old English uh, fledge, fledgy, maybe. Uh, this meant that the feathers were ready to fly. Okay. Thus, it came to mean fully developed. So this is where it actually does come from. All right, and we have um, you know, four examples of this. Uh, the coronavirus started as an epidemic and grew into a full-fledged pandemic. Okay, you know, of course, pandemics are a lot larger than epidemics. All right, number two here. Their new government grew into a full-fledged democracy. Okay, maybe before that, I don't know, maybe it was a dictatorship or, uh, you know, some sort of tyrannical government, but it, it broke free and it grew into a full-fledged democracy. Okay, number three here. She used to, to just be a caretaker, but after getting her nurse's certification, she became a full-fledged nurse. So then maybe she started to actually get a job in a hospital, working full-time in the hospital. All right, number four, that baby bird now has a set of full-fledged feathers, and its mother is trying to teach it to fly. Okay, good. I hope you got it. Um, I hope it's clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.